This is BVI Channel 1. You're welcome back again. On this platform, we tell you the gospel truth. And we keep speaking this truth until Nigerians understand that finally, let them be victims of bad governance. Can you imagine this kind of discovery? Some of you have seen the video. But, <laughs> honestly speaking, we've not seen it all yet. But I want you to take a look at this and imagine a human could do this and i can tell you categorically that it is coming from corrupt government officials watch <laughs> Oh, you ha you have seen it. You have seen it. Oh, how can this happen in a country that is ravaging with poverty and hunger? Now, ask yourself a question. When I say this money, if you go down deep to trace it, it will not. It will not fail to narrow down to either a politician or a government official and a contractor. This is public fund that was designated for public service, for public good. That could fix hospitals. That could pave our roads. That could pay salaries that are being owed. These are the money that are being discovered everywhere. Rotten. Human beings pack this money, stacked it away. It is not coming from a businessman. No, of course, no businessman will keep his money this way to rotten. Now ask yourself, why is it happening in Nigeria? And particularly in the north. <laughs> huh. Some people will say, you people are like money. I'm not trying to be ethnic sentimental here, but... The truth of the matter is that every politician, public service, as you are seeing it happening in the north, it is happening in the south. Now, when foul nash, now when now when um, um wind blew, we go see foul nash. This one is happening in the north. Discoveries now are now being <laughs> start 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 money are now being discovered. Rotten. You can only imagine these men that you call your public servants. Or public witchcrafts because this is the height of witchcraftry, wizardry. This is the height of wickedness. And the Buhari government came on the uh, uh, ways of fighting corruption. This is the evidence of corrupt practices and how deep and how rotten it has eaten deep into the system of this country. Tell me, how can this money get missing if it is missing? And no one called it up. This money, how can this money be stashed away and nobody asked about it if not for a stolen fund? And the government in power looks the other way. All these discoveries that are made, the only person you go blame than a man where they are so rock. Now the president I will begin with, down to the ministry where this money could be coming from. Because it will not it will not, I can never deviate from coming from inside government. Contractors. Money that have been released. Man, it's unfortunate that we have Nigerians suffer in the midst of plenty. 
It's unfortunate. But it is not for Nigerians to make a choice. Come next year. I'll keep speaking it. Whether you are from the east, north, west, and south, whether you are Oduduwa, Adewa, or Biafra, we are all victims of these wicked, corrupt politicians. Until you start retiring them, there is no hope for you. Nami Tokam. Write it down. I will keep saying it. Just write it down. There is no hope for you. As I'm talking to those in the north, I'm talking to those in the south. Because the same thing applies. It is just about a matter of time. You can imagine a human being stash this money and allow it to roughen only to be discovered now why are you discovering it oh because the cbn policy of changing the money or what how wicked people can be how wicked people can be you can only take character of a man at the helm of affairs who is in control of his government problem of bugari is that he is not in control of his government. I Nami Tokam. The man, I am saying it out of what I could see, he's not in control of his government. He should first of all be in control of himself. I saw it. I told Nigerians, they failed to hear. Next year, another man is coming to present himself. If you like, go and vote for him. Go and vote back APC or PDP. Then you understand the real meaning of from frying pan to fire. Or from top to bottom and from bottom to bottomless pit. Let me talk on. Nigerians, it's up to you. Now, now here, I go just end this talk. It is life, it's left for you to go and make your decision come next year. As for me and my family, we remain obedient and useful. Go and get your PVC. You may not understand. Anyone discouraging you is part of your problem. And anyone, where they are abroad, where run away from this country because of bad government, and still support PDP or APC, the kind of thunder will go fire you, the kind of calamity will go before you, eh? I don't care where, whether you are my brother or my friend or my relation, because now you be the source of our problem. Nobody will punish us again with APC and PDP in Asoro. Come next year. I don't talk my own finish. Help me share this video and open the eyes of Nigeria and reset their thinking faculty. Because some of them, they are mumu, na factory fitted, na follow come. Please help me share this video. I'm just the voice. I've delivered a message. The Archbishop and the Advocate for Good Governance. Bye bye for now. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Drop your comments. I want to have your opinion. Stay safe.